Okay, today we're going to be using acrylic paints. Oh, oh, exciting. Now, acrylic paints are relatively new. They were developed last century, whereas oil and watercolours have been around for centuries and centuries and centuries. The people here today have got a wide range of disabilities resulting from the stroke. If you do get it on your clothes, keep it wet until you can wash it and you should be all right. We felt that there was a need for an activity group to get people together do something they enjoyed and in that process they're building confidence, they're doing something that they may not have done since they were at school. I used to do painting years ago and now it's getting me back into painting. I used to they paint it watercolours and now doing this all the other kinds it's giving me a different interest and I'm now going home and trying things where I just sat, sat there and didn't do anything so this is really it's really good dip it into your paint and dab it so you get a very uneven blotchy effect Carla is leading the group at the moment and she has a degree in arts and education. There's also speckling which we will not be doing today. <laughs> As this is using a toothbrush to spray the paint onto your paper. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. do that, yeah. <laughs> We can have a laugh here because we're all in the same boat. So we can have a good fun. Yeah. You'll notice that some people here are using the non-preferred hand, some people have speech problems and some people have been affected with their eyesight. It's helping me a lot. It's just lovely. I've really enjoyed it. Because you're, you're talking to other people and when I think back in May, I could hardly speak at all. It's come on that way a lot for me, seeing everybody and it's, it's fun. I think the idea is that people attend the group for as long as they need to. Maybe some of the younger members will feel that after a period of time they could perhaps engage in other activities. For others they have made friends here and they may like to continue for longer. We would like to refer new uh, stroke survivors uh, who feel that they might benefit from building their confidence in the future.